Hi guys, this is Kim. Welcome to my channel. Just wanted to do a quick flip through of a journal that I made for Junk Journal Junkies, uh, the All About Bird Swap. Um, and it was to be made from a 9 by 12 envelope, manila envelope, so that's what this is. And the cover, I did the like a napkin technique to make it look kind of leathery with um, uh, Mod Podge and all kinds of distress inks and I love how it came out. It feels so cool. And then I just put some lace on the binding and some pictures that I got from Pinterest. And um, all the lace and everything I dyed. Uh, I mixed some coffee and some tea together. And that's what I did with all the papers. I dyed them all with that mix. And um, I sewed around a bunch of the pictures. And I made this little flower here. And just added some more flowers. And some burlap and a little metal piece. And a quote up here. And I just tied it together with some dyed seam binding. So let's dive on in. And on the first page, um, I just put some lace, dyed lace. It is a tuck spot. You can use it as one. I didn't put anything in it. And then another, just a quote that I got off of Pinterest. And most of my pages, I made them myself on PZAP. Um, you, can, you, you can do your own collages. So I just kind of randomly got all different pictures from Pinterest and Ephemera's Vintage Garden and My Besties. I have some digi kits from them and I, I used their program, it's free, and did all my papers. And that's how I printed out even all of this stuff. Um, this is a belly band and another quote and um, I have a little my uh, memory box die that's a feather and I put some fibers behind it and then this was a card and I cut it I just fussy cut it and I bought all these from oh there's so many different stores on Etsy I can't keep track <laughs> and um, this is a coffee filter that I dyed um, in the tea and coffee mixture and then I put um, different distress inks over it and then after that I put um, gel medium over that because it gives it a lot of like like this is going nowhere it's not gonna rip kind of gives it kind of a leathery feeling it works really well another quote a little tuck spot double tuck with just some journal paper there's a lot of journaling room in in this journal I like to have a lot of places to write and there is a tag and this moves up so you can do some secret writing under there and um, this is just the file folder uh, I made tags out of it so that it would go all the way through so I could get two and then I just put some flowers over to over the bread and some more lined paper and some more coffee dyed paper with a banner and a little bit of trim and here's a little tuck spot and I just made with index cards some writing spots get that in there and I sewed some lace on and then there's a giant tag in there let me get that over there with a doily and just a smile always this is so outside my box these birds I had a, I had a blast actually looking online for all the pictures there's so many pretty ones out there I made another tag with the feathers and then I did some of my own glimmer mist on the back and this is a Martha Stewart punch. Some more pretty paper that I made. And another tuck spot with another one of those cards. And there's some little feathers on here and a flower and some rhinestones. And some more paper. This is actually um, grunge lace paper from Dreams Etc. Love their stuff getting ready to do an Alice in Wonderland journal with their stuff. Um, an altered paper clip that I made. Another tag with another movable spot. And a tuck. And this is an envelope that goes over the other side. Decorated a little bit here. And there's a little card in the envelope. Some more of that grunge lace paper. Glassine bag with a little tag in it. And here's a little belly band that I put a real feather in. 
And then there's some Project Life cards, and I put little birds on all of them. Another little tuck spot, another tag. And this is all just washi tape. Another tag. I use some stenciling on the back and some lace. And some more of the papers that I made. This is a my besties paper. Another little tuck spot with the little real feathers. There's another my besties paper. And these are just all pictures that I got off of Pinterest. Another tag, and this is a double tuck spot. There's a tuck there, too. This is my besties paper, also. Ooh, let's get that to turn. A little quote. And some pretty peacock tags. And here's the center of the signature. I just made it into a pocket. Put another little tag in there. It says, believe in yourself. Let me get that on screen there. Some more journaling, another pretty picture of birds. Another altered paper clip that I made. Another project life card that I added a bird to. More birds. And a little tag I made. I love these little bingo cards, so what did I do? Added a bird. <laughs> and some lace. And here's that um, memory box die I have again. Love that thing, it's so pretty. More papers, another quote, another altered paper clip. This is that grunge lace paper, too. And then here's another big tag in the tuck that I made. It says the possibilities are endless. Oh, let me get that in frame. Sorry about the lighting, it's terrible in here. It's getting ready to snow. It's spring break, and it's getting ready to snow. A large tag with lace. And some fibers and a pretty bird. Here's another glassine bag that I put a real feather in. A little belly band. A little tag. Another feather. Some more pretty bird pictures. Just stuck some lace. Here's another one of those tags. And these I just kind of, I just put the distress inks all over those too. This is another tuck. There's also a little tuck up here. More grunge lace. And here's a doily tuck with another one of the index cards. And just a little piece of lace. A little flower. Some journaling paper. Another altered paper clip that I made. Another big tuck tag. Did some stenciling on this one too. That one also. And I just used the, the distress inks on the stencil. And put some lace on there. Here's some more of the real little tiny feathers. They're so pretty. Another pretty bird paper. Another one of those tags. More grunge lace paper. Another tuck spot. And here's the other side of that coffee filter. And I just put another quote on there. Another tuck. Another quote and another little belly band at the end. And this is the end, and I um, I did put some different cards that I found in my stash that have birds on them. So I thought that would be good for my partner to have. Uh, so that is my All About Birds journal. Um, hope you enjoy it. Can't wait to see what everybody else does. And thank you for watching. Bye!